DC have announced the fourth new show to be made for their new streaming service. It's titled Metropolis and is a prequel to Superman coming to Metropolis. And it seems to have a lot in common with the show Gotham, which is of course a prequel to Batman coming to Gotham. In fact, two of the executive producers from Gotham, Johnny Stevens and Danny Cannon, are actually working on Metropolis as well. The show is going to follow Lois Lane and Lex Luthor as they discover fringe science and Metropolis's dark underworld before the arrival of Superman in the city. Not exactly sure what fringe science will mean, but I imagine the discovering of the underworld will involve Lex Luthor starting out as not exactly a hero, but certainly not a villain, and he and Lois Lane want to end the corruption. But then he'll slowly turn to the dark side as the show goes on, in order to one day control the underworld of Metropolis. Though no one knows for certain what will feature on the show and what the plots will be. All we know is that Superman will not be present and 13 episodes have been ordered. Metropolis will begin production later this year and is set to be released in 2019 on DC's new streaming service. Now as I said this is the fourth announced series being made for DC's new streaming service which really needs a better name, something that's easier to pronounce in these videos at least. The other shows are of course the live action Titans and the animated series of Harley Quinn and Young Justice Outsiders. And I've got to say that I'm not really liking the idea of this Metropolis show that much. I get that people like to do prequels, but why doesn't anyone want to do a sequel? Instead of seeing Lois Lane's life before Superman comes to Metropolis, I'd rather see her life after Superman comes to Metropolis. Why can't Superman be on the show with Lois Lane? After all, we've got The Flash on a TV show, and then we've got another Flash in the live action movies. So why can't they do the same with Superman? Or better yet, let's move away from Superman and do some of the other DC heroes. After all, there are literally thousands of characters to choose from in the DC Universe, and I'd much rather see a show about the other, less known members of the DC Universe, and not just the famous ones like Batman, Superman and Wonder Woman. But maybe that's just me. Although if you do agree, feel free to say so in this video's comments. And to be fair, the show may actually end up being quite good, we'll have to wait and see. But what do you think of the show Metropolis being made? Are you excited? And what other new shows would you like DC to make and add to their new streaming service? Be sure to let us know in the comments, and I'd just like to say a quick thank you to those who made this video possible by donating to the Needle Mouse Productions page on Patreon. Patreon is a crowdfunding site that is helping us to bring you more videos each week and to raise funds for adapting comic book stories into short animated films. If you're interested in donating or just want to find out more, a link is in this video's description. And as always, thanks for watching and feel free to subscribe, share, like and comment.